Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what's in my Lihid Lab pin case. If you're interested, the link to this case will be in the description box below. So just a bit about this product, it is designed for arrangement, which means that the inside compartments are movable. For the inside, you can choose to have two separate compartments or one section but with a little pouch for storing your eraser. I personally like to keep mine with one bigger compartment so I can store my longer pens such as the Tombow ABT Dual Brush Pens. So the first pen I always carry around with me is the Pentel Energel 0.7mm. It writes so smooth and it just makes my handwriting look so organized and pretty. Next, I have a Pentel Sign Pen. This is the one with the hard felt tip, so it works like a fine liner, however, I really wish I purchased the soft tip brush pen. For pencils, I carry the Simpson one, and it has a really unique design, and it is also a shaker pencil. Of course, I would have to have my favorite highlighters, the Zebra and Mile Liners. I currently have a pack of it and I love how it's double-ended. So one end has a chisel tip for the daily typical highlighting, and then the other end is a thinner marker light one for drawing boxes and underlining. In addition to those Mild Liners, I also carry my pack of Pastel Pilot Friction Highlighters. They give a very light pastel look, and I love the fact that they're completely erasable. It has the typical chisel tip for highlighting, and on the end of the pin, it has a rubber for friction erasing. As expected, I obviously have to own a Muji pin. However, as much as I love the pen itself, it's a little overrated, and every time I try to highlight, it completely smudges the text I have written. Next, I keep this Papermate Inkjoy 0.7mm pen. Lately, it's been skipping quite a bit and not as smooth as before, so I might consider switching this one for a different pen. And here I have a colored Muji gel pen. This is the dark green one in 0.38mm, and it has the same problem with smudging, but then other than that, the ink floats really smoothly. And lastly, for pens, I store my all-time favorite brush pens by Tombow. I usually keep three of them at one time, but I do switch out the colors quite often. For Tombow brush pens, they offer a very similar design to the mild liners. They have a brush tip on one side and a marker or like felt tip on the other. Supplies wise, I have this 15cm ruler that I store in my pen case. This is really handy for basically all of my classes and that's why I keep it here. And the last and most important thing, a whiteout for correcting all the mistakes I make and as well as an eraser, which I forgot to film about. And now for the giveaway. I have partnered up with Personal Planners to bring you guys this giveaway. I'll be giving away a gift card that has the value of $59 to their official website. For me personally, I purchased a planner of the A5 size, and I was also able to purchase a few pins. To enter, please check out my Instagram post on this giveaway, which will be linked in the description box below. Thank you guys so much for watching. As usual, don't forget to subscribe and check out more of my contents, and all giveaway information will be listed below. So good luck, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!